welcome back everybody. I am Andrea Jean and today we are doing a relaxing speed clean. I know those two things often don't go in the same sentence, but yes, we are going to chill out and we're going to tidy up our house as quickly as possible. <laughs> Be sure to grab yourself a nice hot cup of coffee, tea, water, soda, whatever your fancy is, and let's get to cleaning. My family and I are going to be going out for an adventure after this, but I just want to tidy up our house, especially because we had relatives over the previous night after a barbecue. So time to get some stuff done. If you're new here, go ahead, hit that subscribe button so you do not miss any motivating content coming your way. Let's get into it. I've realized these pants slash leggings are super bright. I knew they were bright, but now seeing them in the footage, wow. Yep, that's something else there. But I think it's a good resemblance of my personality. Fun, adventurous, and always up for a laugh and a good time. I'm not quite sure I'll wear these again, but uh, yeah, there's something. Uh, they do look cute with that top slash dress thingy there. We're starting in the kitchen. We're going to get these dishes out of the sink. And you all, I got my cleaning gloves. I am so happy about them. This is one of the best gifts of 2019, and it was like three bucks at Walmart. So can't go wrong with that. I do not know why I didn't get cleaning gloves any sooner. Let's get this kitchen all whipped into shape. You all, I think we conquered the ant situation. When it got warm, those ants thought they were gonna come into our house. We had some ant traps and then my husband sprayed something and that helped significantly. So I'm gonna go ahead and put those ant traps away. They are a bit of an eyesore, especially if you have company over. You don't really want them seeing that. We've been sanitizing and wiping the counters down like crazy. And prior to this, we couldn't leave hardly any dishes in the sink because they would be all over it. I'm hoping they are gone for the season, but we will see. Fingers crossed, you all. One of the things that we're going to do after we're done tidying up the house is we're going to look for tomato plants. I have never done this before, but I'm looking forward to having a little project with my five-year-old daughter and keeping tomato plants in the pots and taking care of them. So if you have any suggestions, please let me know in the comments. I don't have the first clue about gardening, but this is our first year in the house and I thought this would be really fun. We have a cat that we take care of, but it's not the quite same 
as a plant. I don't know if from experience, cats are pretty self-sufficient, but I know plants can be a little bit finicky and I do not know a whole lot about produce. So yeah, any insights, let me know in the comments. Just helping my daughter out here with a project that she's working on. Don't worry, my husband is primary on kid duty right now. Well, I just take an hour or so to do some speed cleaning here. Now we're gonna go ahead and flip some laundry. I just love that sun shining in. I am someone who likes to change up my laundry routine. And also, if you've been watching, I like to change up where I fold it. It's usually here on the bed just because it's more comfortable or in the living room. And sometimes I'll go into the kitchen on the table. I think just a change of scenery, you know, just kind of makes it a little bit more enjoyable as well as good music and coffee. But lately what I've been doing is as soon as the washer is full, I'll go ahead and run a load. So I'm always just putting clothes in the washer from the laundry baskets if I'm walking past the bedroom. And then I'll tend to sort it all on one day. And then the following day, or let's be honest, two days, I will go ahead and put it away. Ideal scenario would be that I sort it and put it all away. However, it is so time consuming and I usually save my laundry for the end of my cleaning routine. So that's what works for now. Now, again, I'm always open to suggestions. I'm always interested in trying different things out. In my 30 something years of life, I have done a whole gamut of different laundry routines. Now on to our downstairs bathroom. favorite part and that is making these mirrors sparkle it is such a gorgeous day you all i cannot wait to finish this up here and get outside but i hope that i provided you with some cleaning motivation to get a few things done around your house i just try to do a little every day and it makes it a bit more manageable and a less stress and cluttered <music> Thank you. 
Thank you so much for joining me here today. I just wanted to get a few things done around the house, just kind of keep up on things. I think it helps with overall overwhelm. The kids are getting a little bit wily, so we're gonna head out here. We're actually going to a local coffee shop that just opened, so I hope it's a good experience. I'm all about supporting local business. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead, give it a thumbs up real life. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and we'll see you all in the next one. Also, here are two additional videos that I think <laughs> here are two additional videos that I think you will also enjoy for some additional motivation. Take care.